The Little League champs, get this, they are going to Disney World. Just like the pros, they will be celebrated with a Main Street USA parade at the Magic Kingdom on Thursday. That parade starts at 1.30 in the afternoon. The city of Lake Mary is also gearing up for Saturday's big celebration. Plans are still underway, but city and county officials are certain it is going to be huge. We're talking one for the history books. Yeah, News 6's Emily McLeod joins us now live from downtown Lake Mary, where you can expect to see thousands of people there to give these boys the celebration that they have earned. Emily. Absolutely. Without a doubt, a ton of people are going to be in downtown Lake Mary on Saturday, and we got a pretty exciting update from the city of Lake Mary. They just sent out a press release within the last hour or so, not only confirming the parade route for Saturday, but we just spoke to Parks and Rec Director for the city of Lake Mary, Brian Knife, and he gave us a few more details about what we can expect to see in the parade and who we can expect to see on Saturday. Seminole County Commissioner Amy Lockhart is ready to celebrate Lake Mary's Little League World Series win. I think it's going to be something for the record books, not just for the athletic record books, but for the community. The city of Lake Mary says plans have been in the works for weeks. The city sending out new details about the parade on Tuesday. Parks and Rec Director for the city of Lake Mary, Brian Knight, giving us more details about what we can expect. The kids will get recognition and things like that, but along the way, uh, the kids get to ride in the back or in uh, convertible Corvettes and awesome. from what I hear, monster <laughs> trucks. Um, we have mascots from the theme parks, also uh, also the major sports organizations from across Central Florida. Knipe says the city has been positively overwhelmed with support for Saturday's celebration. The event is completely supported and any additional support, we know the Lake Mary Little League kids and families can probably use it. Lake Mary is within Lockhart's district. She says she anticipates thousands of people will be there on Saturday. I was in South Florida this weekend and there are uh, community members who live in other counties throughout the state who when they found out I was from Seminole County wanted to come and talk about this great team and so people are paying attention all over. How excited are you for Saturday and for this Lake Mary Little League team? We are so incredibly excited for these kids, for these players, their families, um, the coaches. This is a once in a lifetime, maybe never in a lifetime experience for our community and uh, there's really very few words that I think adequately express the excitement in the air, you can just feel it. The city says we can also expect to see some elected officials and some former professional baseball players. Now, I do want to go over arguably one of the most important details ahead of Saturday, and that's going to be the parking. Now, we just spoke to Brian Knipe, and in the press release that the city sent out, they gave out some designated parking areas. So I'm going to go ahead and read those suggestions off of my phone. They say people can park at the Sunrail Station. They can park at Seminole State College, designated downtown parking, and public lots located throughout the city. So take down those notes. We're also going to have those details posted on ClickOrlando.com in case you need a refresher before Saturday. I'm going to send it back to you all over in studio. All right, 12-year-old boys in convertibles and monster <laughs> trucks. It sounds like a pretty perfect, right. perfect day. Absolutely. Yes. Emily McLeod live Very from Lake well Mary. Thank you. Yep.